Hey guys, it's me, My Reborns, and I am back with another video. It was that, that that was a lot, wasn't it? It was too much. See, I was thinking to myself, that's a lot. Like you're doing a lot right now. But it is Wednesday, November 24th, and it's currently 6.59 p.m. And I have my reborn baby, Zaire, right here, who was the Levi kit by Bonnie Brown. Oh, uh, do you guys look kind of blurry? I might have to clean. Oh, okay. I don't know what's going on. I really don't know. Um, I have Zaire here. I'm going to be changing him and my other three, other two baby boys in their Thanksgiving outfits. Like I told you guys before. I'm not changing Claudia and Scarlett. They are for sale. There is an amazing Black Friday deal on them. So that will be in the video that I post on Friday because this is getting posted tomorrow, which is Thursday, which is Thanksgiving. <laughs> is it giving? And um, you don't want to miss it. There's prices that are going to be super cheap, which is why I'm only doing it for 24 hours. Only 240 N L Y. Did I just say that? I don't know what's going on with me, but I know I'm not going to be talking in this video. Maybe I'm just trying to get it all out right now. I don't know. But in my last video of me changing Eilina into her outfit, I asked you all a question. I actually asked about four or five questions. Nobody answered. We still friends. But nobody answered. Except for, I don't know if I'm going to pronounce her name correctly. Odessa? Odessa? I think it's Odessa. Uh, thank you so much for being the only person to answer my questions. I really appreciate it so, so much. So you guys have to watch my videos and answer my questions because if you don't answer it, my mind is going like 100 miles per hour. But anyway, she was the only one who answered my questions. So once again, thank you so much. I'm going to be changing the boys into their Thanksgiving outfit. I'm going to change all of them in this one video, speed it up. Uh, but I am going to show you guys what he's going to be wearing before I start changing him. So guys, don't talk about Zaire and his outfit, okay? Because we, why does he have this pacifier? <laughs> we, uh, we, were, we were trying things. So I was supposed to get all the babies corresponding uh, outfits, matching outfits, as well as myself. But y'all, that came out, that was too much money. Your girl is broke. I don't, I don't got no money. So they had to wear what we had here, okay? So they're all going to be wearing completely different stuff, but whatever. And out of all the outfits I ears, this outfit is my least favorite because, y'all, I didn't have anything for him. And I even checked Chandler's box full of stuff and I didn't find anything that I liked in there either. And I even bought like a whole lot of clothes a while back of newborn boy clothes and I didn't like anything in there either. So, Zaire... He's just gonna have to wear this. Anyway, let me hurry up and actually start showing stuff. All right, this is just a Carter's onesie and it's long sleeve. And I don't know what this is. I don't know my animals. So y'all gonna have to figure it out on y'all own, but it got a cute little red scarf, got some trees, mountains. That's what he's gonna wear. I know, it's not too Thanksgiving-y. Then he's borrowing his uh, big brother. Chandler pants, they're just zero three. They're really big and wide, so these will fit Chandler perfectly, but they're just gray. And then we got some white and burgundy sakis. They're more of a red, and they matched more yesterday when I picked them out. <laughs> um, but anyway, let's just go ahead and get this video started, and let me change them into this outfit. Also, before I change them, this is a new angle um, it's similar to uh, Eilina's angle that I had in the video that I posted recently. And it's similar, but he is actually like facing the camera. And I had him like this. And I also had Eilina like this as well. But I think I like him facing you guys better to change him. And I did ask you guys to let me know which angle you like better. Me changing Chandler that video if you guys like that angle or me changing Eilina and now there's another point of view me changing Zaire I'm only gonna ask y'all that one question and maybe one more so can y'all please answer it like am I asking for too much all right let's get changing all 
Okay, so I'm all finished changing Zaire. I hope, hope, hope I was not blocking the camera with my huge, big quarterback shoulders, okay? Because I hate when I edit my videos and y'all can't see anything when I'm changing the videos because my shoulders are in the way. So I'm going to take you guys off the tripod quickly, quickly, quickly and swiftly. And so here's Zaire and his outfit. I mean, it's not that bad, okay? It's not that bad. More december -y, christmas -y, but it isn't too bad for Thanksgiving. I feel so bad because his outfit compared to the other baby's outfit, it's like I don't even love him. But I do. I love him so much. Zaire is so chunky. And I tried to tell you guys, this newborn onesie is so snug. It's like so tight, just like Eileen's onesie that's on her. And the crazy thing is Levi is supposed to be a like large preemie small newborn size baby and he doesn't fit any preemie and he barely fits newborn i do like to put newborn on him though because he does fit it good but i can get away with putting zero to three on him so i love the levi kit so so much and now it's time to change the javen and then we're gonna change chandler and look at this look at that mess we're gonna be changing Jalen and chandler and then that's gonna be it <laughs> all right next we have my big boy javen and he's sitting in this chair because i saw in cassandra's video that sand sand babies go subscribe to her on youtube and go follow her on instagram i was watching her video of her changing her liam by bonnie brown who was iris so beautiful and she had changed her in like this a chair just like this so i decided to give it a try with Javen because I think they might be around the same size. Javen might be a tad bit smaller than uh, the Liam kit, but I just decided to give it a try because I think this this might be better than me changing him on the bed like the rest of the babies. Now it's gonna be very difficult for me to actually change him because I am in like an awkward position and there's like hardly any room over here for me to actually change him, but I'm gonna try my best, okay? So, let me show you guys what he's going to be wearing quickly, quickly, quickly. You guys are going to love this outfit. Look how cute. It would be nice if you focus. Okay, so it's this cute Cherokee sweater, size 12 months. And I don't know what type of material it is. I think maybe thermal, but it's like a thin sweater. It's actually weird. It's like thin at the bottom and then a little bit thicker at the top. But it's gray and then it's outlined in like black. Kind of looks like a navy blue but it's black and uh so that's what he's gonna wear for his shirt and then for his pants he's gonna wear like these khaki type of pants they're so cute so cute they're just tan and these are carter size 12 months and we already established that he fits carter 12 months really good because the little sweatpants that he have on right now are from carter's and they're 12 months and then we just got him some socks and the crazy thing is i have some uh, gray and black socks that would go perfect with that but Chandler wore it last and I don't know what I did with him I didn't feel like looking so he's just gonna wear those socks so let's go ahead and get started on changing him and I might do his hair on camera or I might do his hair tomorrow I don't know I don't know we'll see Okay, so I'm all finished changing Javen, and y'all boy is looking so fresh. I might go back and try to find those black and gray socks because I feel like it would actually put the outfit together. Since he doesn't have, I don't have any shoes that he can wear. I told y'all the story about these shoes, but I edited it out. Should I do a quick story time right now? No, I'm not going to. I would do a story time on the shoes later. I edited out my other video for a reason because that video was too long, and so... I edited that part out of, about the shoes, but I don't have any shoes that fit him. I can at least try to make his outfit look pretty cute without the sh without any shoes. So let me take you guys off of the tripod, and I did not take his hair out of the braids. So here's his outfit. It is so cute. Every time I put him in an outfit, which has been three times now, I just always get so shocked that his previous mommy put him in 6 to 9 and said that he wore 6 to 9 because this is 12 months and as you guys see, it does look a tad bit 
big and um but it's still cute i just feel like the 69 would just be too small like maybe nine months by itself is probably maybe the perfect fit but 69 just feels tight so here's his outfit he's not gonna be wearing those braids just because they are old and uh you know after a while the braids start to look a little messy so i'm still figuring out a hairstyle i have about three hairstyles in mind i don't know what we're gonna do for his hair but i may add a clip after this of what i did to his hair so that you guys can see it but that will have to be like right now that i will have to do something to his hair because this video is getting posted tomorrow so yeah but anyways this is javen's outfit and let's go ahead and change chandler all right last but not least we have mr chandler wandler he's the last baby to get changed and i did the order that i did because of how i previously changed them like eilena she's been the baby who hasn't got changed the longest which is why she was the first then was year. Then you guys know I just changed Javen and I literally just changed Chandler so that's why they were last even though I changed them and I landed about two days apart, three days apart. Anyway, are you guys ready to see what Chandler is going to be wearing? Alright, so he came to me with this outfit, super cute. Um, It's just this Carter's little shirt. Look how cute it is. It would have been better if there were turkeys on there or something and not dinosaurs. But I think just because of the style of it, he'll be able to pull it off for Thanksgiving. And I think it's still kind of cute. That's what he's going to be wearing for the shirt. And then I decided to pair it up with these thick old pants from Cat and Jack. One thing about Cat and Jack, their pants for the babies are so thick. Like, they're making sure all the little babies and their little leggies are warm. So... This is what he's going to be wearing. And I have some, come on, come on, come on. I have some brown bear socks. We might put these shoes on him. We might. We have to see how they look first. So let's go ahead and get Chandler changed and finish out this video. And I hope there's, that it's not long because I got to edit this. Get it uploaded. Do a thumbnail. Da da da. Da da da. By tomorrow. No, by tonight actually. And it's already 7.29. 7.29. Jeez Louise. Y'all, I just have to stop this little um, clip. I gotta stop this clip oh my gosh so the camera was falling and i like grabbed it and my whole entire nail not a half of a nail my whole entire nail bent back like right here you guys oh it stinks this line right here is how far it bent back so i'm about to cut this off with uh the clippers the nail clippers oh my gosh like I have this little kit and literally just yesterday the nail clippers were in here and now it's not this is just my luck whenever you need something you can't let me finish this video before i get super mad and irritated newsflash chandler cannot fit this <laughs> he can't fit the shirt and i always know it's going to be a risk putting newborn on him because he's literally not newborn but he came with it so i just thought i'd give it a try so now mr chandler has nothing to wear <laughs> got so much hair on him now he has nothing to wear guys this is just our luck isn't it buddy isn't it just our luck i knew it wasn't gonna fit because look it's like literally cutting off his circulation I'm gonna have to see if there's just a zero to three month i don't know I don't know, buddy. You're not going to be part of the Thanksgiving photos. You or Zaire. It's just going to have to be Javen and Eileen, I guess. I don't know. Let's see if we can find a onesie or a shirt or something for Chandler. Because if we can't, then he's just going to have to be naked and go like that. I'm not liking any of the onesie choices. So we just going to put him in a white onesie and call it a day. Okay. Also, I ended up finding nail clippers and I clipped down my nail and it hurts really bad it's red it's like burning and stinging a little bit but it's not like horrible excruciating pain okay let's just go ahead and finish changing him
We're all done changing Chandler. And I'm not going to put the shoes on him because, as you guys saw, they did not look right. I'm trying to hurry up and speak because I feel like the ring light's going to cut off. As you guys saw in the clip before, when I was changing him, they cut off. Like, why can't I ever be great? There's a lot of bad stuff happening. But we have Chandler changed. I changed this angle real quick because I'm grabbing Zaire. We have, oh, goodness. We have Zaire changed. And then last, but absolutely not least, we got Javen changed. He says hi. So, all three of the boys are changed. My beautiful baby girl, Eilina, is changed. And all of the babies are now changed into their Thanksgiving outfit. And, um, yeah, they look so cute. Even though it didn't really work out how I wanted it to. But they still look adorable because they are adorable. I do have a question for you all. Two questions. That's all you gotta answer. The question I asked in the beginning with the angles. And then this one, okay? It's, it's not that hard. So, my question to you all is, what is your favorite Thanksgiving food? Mine is baked macaroni and cheese. And if you ask me what my favorite food is, I will literally say baked macaroni and cheese. But no one cooks it unless it's at a barbecue or a special occasion as Thanksgiving, Christmas. Those are like the only time people cook baked macaroni and cheese. Why can't I have baked macaroni and cheese once a week? I will even settle for once a month, but no, I have to wait until November, December, and sometimes June, July, August. I I need everybody to start making baked macaroni and cheese more regularly. Please and thank you. So you guys let me know in the comments below what's your favorite Thanksgiving food. Okay, one more question. That's it. That's it. Just one more. Just answer one more. What are you guys doing? I'm uploading this on Thanksgiving. What are you guys doing for Thanksgiving? I'm, I'm just going to be seeing my family that live out here you guys know i don't have much family i don't have any friends out here i'm just going to be going to see them and just hanging out with the family that i do have here and i wish i was with my friends but those are the only three questions i have angles favorite thanksgiving food what are you doing if you guys want to follow me on instagram go ahead and follow me at my underscore reborns i am on reborns.com under melanated baby so if you guys want to please go ahead and follow me over there if you guys want to do my membership to get exclusive videos and posts anything then there is a clickable link in the description for that and for everything i said and that's pretty much it for this video i also have a link tree i've had it for a while but i added a lot of things on there today and I will start to add that in the description as well on my videos. If you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below anything you want, including video requests. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please consider doing so by hitting that subscribe button. Make sure you turn on that bell. Mm, I had 10 seconds left. Make sure you turn on that bell so you guys can always be notified when I post another video. Have an amazing holiday. Happy Thanksgiving. I love you all so, so much. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Maya's out. Bye.